A second day of searching ends without any sign of a missing fisherman at Smithville Lake. 72-year-old Gordon Carr's boat was discovered yesterday morning on the lake, but now he is nowhere to be seen. Zach Tecklenburg has the latest on the search. Gordon Carr's family spent the whole day out here at Smithville Lake waiting for word that never came. They say they still hold out hope. He'll come walking up to them, wondering what all the fuss is about. He's that cool uncle, man, and, and uh, we love him to death. Always, uh, He's always the life of the parties and the picnics. Today looks like it's one of those gatherings for Gordon Carr's family as they sit alongside Smithville Lake. But something is missing. Everybody would probably be busting stitches just last. <laughs> There's still laughter and smiles, but underneath, it's worry. As everyone watches boats from the Missouri State Highway Patrol cruise the water looking for Gordon. Man, he's done this fishing for me thousands of times. Which is why Michael Davis was so shocked to hear the news that his uncle had disappeared. Davis says Gordon's a strong swimmer, too, and came out to Smithville several times a week during the summer. As they wait for news, Michael still has hope his uncle might be alive. And if he's not, they have each other. We stick together no matter what. So good or bad, when we're together, we're together. The search begins again tomorrow morning, and Carr's family says they'll be out here waiting until they find out what happened to Gordon. At Smithville Lake, Zach Tecklenburg, 41 Action News.